My home city of Newcastle upon Tyne has more than its fair share of local landmarks, from monuments to cathedrals to its magnificent seven bridges. But all those things, while lovely, are all pretty normal. Doesn't Newcastle have anything to offer that's a bit weirder? Well, yes. Yes, it does. On the eastern edge of central Newcastle flows the River Ouseburn, whose upper valley is bounded by some of the loveliest urban parks the city has to offer, including Jesmond Dean and Heaton Park, which are not only beautiful communal green spaces, but also contain a variety of historic structures and fascinating secrets for visitors to stumble across as they explore. Today, I've come to Armstrong Park in Heaton, to find Newcastle's strangest landmark. And it's this tree right here. Oh, just an ordinary tree? But wait, what's that in its branches? Huh, it seems like there's a story here. And there is, only no one really seems to know it for sure. Let's start with what we do know. This large sycamore tree in Armstrong Park has been bedecked with old shoes for decades. It's something of a local tradition that students marking an important milestone like passing their exams will come and throw their shoes up among the branches. Since this tradition has been going on for so long, the tree has become something of a time capsule for Geordie footwear fashion. Sometimes, the shoes will build up to such an extent that the tree branches will start to bend under the weight, and the local council has been forced to periodically come round and prune the footwear away to protect the tree from damage. Which, you've got to say, is quite a funny turn of events. But here's the thing. While it's said that generations of local students have celebrated their academic successes by adding to the tree's adornments, no one can say for sure when or how the tradition really started, which has led some canny individuals to fill in the gap with a few tall tales. This sign, for example, appeared mysteriously near the tree in 2012, asserting that the shoe throwing definitely dated all the way back to 1627. But though we may never know who first adorned this sycamore with their old pair of trainers, or more importantly, why, we do know that the tree has become a unique and beloved landmark in the area, and the shoe tree tradition, such as it is, is going stronger than ever. In fact, in 2020, the Woodland Trust shortlisted the shoe tree for its seventh annual UK Tree of the Year contest, proving beyond doubt that this strange, shoe-laden tree now occupies a truly meaningful place at the heart of its community. If you've just passed your exams, you've got some old shoes lying around, and you'd like to leave an offering to the old woodland spirits to give thanks, you can find the Heaton Shoe Tree in Armstrong Park in Newcastle. Just don't be surprised if the council soon comes around and cuts them down. 